So we're seeing a lot of states and utilities set some pretty aggressive net zero carbon emissions goals. Hydrogen carries a lot of energy on a per mass basis. So it really offers a potential path for alternate sources of generation that are non-carbon emitting. So there's this resurgence of interest in a hydrogen economy. Um, that was something that we heard buzz about 15 to 20 years ago with the development of uh, fuel cell vehicles. But today we hear about different industries investigating potential use cases for hydrogen, things like the transportation sector with fuel cell vehicles, or even end use within homes and district heating. Another potential pathway is energy storage. Hydrogen represents a storable commodity, much like natural gas. One of the potential pathways is building an industrial end use. This has traditionally been kind of an area that's harder to decarbonize. Another pathway is power generation. And this is one that's pretty exciting as there have been kind of some recent announcements to develop a turbine generator that's powered exclusively on hydrogen. In this report, we take a close look at hydrogen. What are some of the challenges it faces and why hasn't it taken off in the past? But also, what changes exist today within the energy sector that make it a promising alternative for carbon-free energy?